Hello everyone, and uh, it's good to be back with you. And uh, thank you again for all the wonderful comments um, that I'm getting. And I'm gathering from some of the things that are being uh, said to me both uh, online and in person that some of the thoughts that I'm sharing with you um, apparently affect are affecting other people. So I guess I'm not the only one who is uh, who is experiencing different things during the day. And so I really um, I'm really enjoying making these videos so I can share my thoughts and hopefully uh, make a difference. So, you know, the last uh, this last week, you know, I was starting to feel, I thought I was feeling depressed and I'm gonna be 51 in January and uh, a friend of mine said, well, you know, you're having a midlife crisis. And I said, you know, I'm normally a pretty happy-go-lucky person and I don't know if that's true. So I called a friend of mine and uh, she's, a, she's a licensed uh, clinical social worker and I said, you know, uh, I said I think I'm depressed and she she said to me well how many people have you helped this week and I looked back at my calendar and realized that it, you know I hadn't been as busy this week as perhaps um, I would like to have been and I said you know I really didn't I don't think I helped that many people this, this week and she said she said you're not depressed you're bored she said you need to go out there and help more people and when you help more people and you give of yourself guess what you won't feel depressed you won't feel bored and you'll be happy or happier so, you know, I took her advice and Thursday and a little bit this morning, I spent calling former clients um, and getting back to people that I hadn't gotten back to in a while just to see how things were going with them. And um, turned out I was able to help a few more people uh, yesterday and a little bit this morning. And you know what? I feel much better. So I think, you know, sometimes we, we think we're depressed and maybe you are. Um, but sometimes we're not depressed, we're just so focused on ourselves that we um, lose sight of what we're really here for, which is to help other people. So um, I'm going to spend, I'm going to make more effort to help more people. And um, one of the things that we, uh, we have in the works here at Drug and Alcohol Tony's is a brand new website that I'm building. Uh, and I'm building it primarily because, um, uh, because I think I can reach more people. Uh, and if I can reach more people, I can help more people. And that's what um, it really is the bedrock and the foundation of our business model, right? Is helping more people and, you know, getting out there and making a difference. So um, we're building a new website. It should be up the next four to five weeks. And um, the other thing that I, I told my web, uh, my web designer is I want to make, I want to have a bigger presence on social media because if I can have a bigger presence, um, then I can help more people, right? I mean, so you see the sort of underlying philosophy here is to help more people and by helping more people then I can grow a bigger business and I can help more people and then I won't be calling my friend to tell her I'm depressed when really I just need to help more people. So that's sort of my, my first thought of the day. Second thought was um, I got an opportunity to 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 watch the president's um, speech yesterday about the opioid addiction crisis uh, health issue that we're having here in this country. and. Well, I'm happy that the president certainly recognizes, as we all do, that work in this arena, that we have a significant problem. Um, my thought is this, show me the money. Show us, show us that you're willing to put your money where your mouth is. Because um, as I have sort of routinely said over the last couple of years is that this is a problem that could be fixed in large part by throwing money at it. And what I mean by that is you have to make treatment available to everybody. Um, you know, the vast majority of people in the criminal justice system are there because they have an addiction or mental health uh, issue. And the people that I deal with on a daily basis, families, you know, who are being destroyed by the diseases of addiction and mental health, come to me because, they, you know, most of the time they've either never had access to treatment or never had access to somebody who could help them to get into treatment. So, you know, until we are, are making treatment available to everybody as opposed to those people that can cash pay or have, an, or have health insurance, I don't see this problem going away in any significant, you know, in any significant manner. So, you know, I hope that, you know, we're going to take some of this money and use it wisely. Um, and I have written about um, one of the solutions that I think is appropriate, you know, um, and I know we, get, we there's been a lot of publicity down here in Florida, especially that, you know, all the private treatment centers or a lot of the private treatment centers are the problem. And, you know, frankly, I disagree. I do not think the private treatment centers on the whole are a problem. In fact, I think a lot of them could be the solution. 
And I hope that the money that comes to Florida, if it comes, and supposedly it is, is not going to be you know, given to bureaucrats and politicians who are only good at spending money and you know, not good at using it wisely. I hope that there'll be an opportunity for some of the really excellent treatment providers that we have down here in South Florida that make a difference every day by helping people will have an opportunity to have access to that money because then we can use it wisely uh, to help a lot of people. So I apologize for getting on my political horse. I don't talk a, a lot about my sort of uh, politics as it were, but when I heard the president's speech yesterday, I really felt like, like that needed some, some commentary. So those are my uh, two thoughts for the day. Get out there, help lots of people. And um, we will uh, hopefully have a chance to chat soon. Thank you.